evening, everybody. Hello. She wrote, take me home to the place I belong, where's such a living at night, take me home. Good evening to you all. Hello, good evening. Welcome to the uh, the Sofa Show. It's nice to have your company. How are you feeling? Uh, how's your day been? Nice bit of sunshine today. Uh, day was all right. Um, just sort of mellowed out, doing a few bits. Felt, felt okay about things. And then saw that on the news, like I think pretty much all of us have now. And I um, don't know. Well, I say I don't know. I do know. I felt quite sad. I sort of welled up. Just felt very emotional because I suppose that man is, the, is our connection between us and us and all the government and all what goes on in them buildings, that's the man, isn't it? Whether you like him or not, different views, a few people I see different comments, kind of irrelevant, isn't it? And then he's got his four kids and one on the way, he's just, just another bloke now that's not well. But he's also our bloke and I think the majority of us all kind of quite like him, you know? I see some critical people and their views, but you know, what would you do? You go and do the job or, you know, what do we know? And no one knows about this because it's not happened before. The last time this happened, there wasn't, it was a different world, so... Just felt really a bit sad and concerned, so th not going to do any funny stuff tonight. I'm just going to sing a few mellow songs. I'm, I was going to just have a little sing for me, and I thought if, if you want to join me and watch a few songs, I'll sing some mellow songs. I'm not too fussed about the comments that come on. You can make a comment, and I'll have, have a look tomorrow. Um, but I'll just share with you something that, that I love to do, which is to sing. So I, I've just sorted out a nice little set. There's nothing lively in there. No smoke tonight. And I've not put the tip thing up. I don't. I don't need to be tipped or anything. Or none of that. I just want. I'd like to sing, share a few songs with you. You know, I can't do anything else than that. You know, for just share a little bit of music. So good evening to you. Thanks for coming tomorrow. If you want to share this, you can. There might be some other people that want to, that want to look. I, I'd like to start with this song. It's been a special song to me since this began. The song "Stand by Me." I'll do it with the, the track and the backing track. But I just thought, you know what? You play guitar, all right, Steve. Just. <laughs> Just try and play it with the guitar, so I will. Never done it with guitar before, but why not? When the night has come and the land is dark And the moon is the only light you see Why won't you afraid? Why won't shed a tear just as long as you stand by me won't you stand by me oh stand by me yes, I'll be okay if you stand by me if the stars Look upon She tumble and fall All the mountains She crumble To the sea I won't Be afraid No I won't Shed a tear Just as long As you stand By me Stand by me, who wants to stand by me? I'll be okay if you stand 
by me I'll be okay if you stand I'll be okay if you stand by me So nice. I've changed a couple of words in that because the truth is I didn't know the words for the song particularly. So I put a couple of additions in. Hello, you. You might see one of the... Hello. Come on, you. Come on. Hey, look, come on, you. Oh, I thought he was going to come up then. He's walked away. What's this? What's that? He knows. I think he knows people are watching. That's the closest they've got. It's one of the two cats that live here. Hey, that's nice. Yeah, stand by me. Good. Nice song, eh? What about this from the Eagles? Just going to do a little mellow few songs, that's all. Just to kind of take our mind off what's going on, the, 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 that. City girls seem to find out early How to open doors just a smile And a rich old man She won't have to worry She'll Dress up all in lace And go in style Late at night Big old house gets lonely I can say every phone The refuge has a price Breaks a heart, think love is on me. Into a man, hands as cold as ice. So she tells him she must go out for the evening to comfort an old friend who's feeling down. And he knows where she's going. As she's leaving, she's heading for the cheat inside of town. You still gotta sing, though. Sing, come on. And you can't hide your lying eyes, and your smile is a thin sky. I thought by now you realize, oh. She gets up, she pours herself a strong one. Stares out at the stars in the sky. And another night, it's gonna be a long one. She draws the shade and hangs her head to cry. Wonders how it ever got so crazy She thinks about a boy she knew at school As she gets out, it is just get lazy She's so far gone, she feels like a fool Your smile, it's a thin disguise. I thought by now you realize, oh, there ain't no way to hide your life. There ain't no way to hide your life, honey.
that's the short version of that for uh, the Eagles song. I'm just checking my phone just to get everything's coming through because I have a couple of people that watch uh, the show, and that's okay. No, so there's no messages there. Excellent. So that's good. So yeah, thank you. So what have you done today? I know oh, that's, not, that's not a silly question because you know, a lot of people have to go and get some essential things and do bits and bobs and doing bits around the home, uh, getting all stuff done. I was just just same old really, and I learned a couple of songs. I looked through a bit of music that I've not sung for a while, I'm trying to compile new lists and that, and on Facebook quite a lot, seeing what people are up to, and uh, yeah, so and not a bad day either. You know, no rain and all that, but it's ironic, isn't it? We get we get a nice little bit of weather. And then uh, it's it's all but impossible to go out, you know, or, or at least meet up with your friends when you're all, oh, well, I didn't go out down the beach or do something for the day, but it's just how it is, eh? So what about this? This is, I learned this for yesterday's show. It's a, it's a Don Williams song. I've never sung it, but I've sung it so many times with other people and hearing it played, I've played it on the show so many times, I kind of know the words. So I thought, I've got a lovely little backing track for this. It's got a little bit of a gospel kind of religious for it. It's called, Lord, I hope this is good. Lord, I hope this day is good. Isn't it? That, that's, 
that's the real essence of easy listening music. There's, there's no big highs and lows. It's just dum, 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 dum. you don't want to get you don't fall asleep to it, but you don't really dance to it. But you would have a little two step shuffle, wouldn't you? If you're at one of the clubs. So that's a, just a, a, a little Don Williams song. I've been doing a version of Amazing Grace for the last couple of weeks, a real lively version. And I thought, you know what? I, I like that. I love the song. And I've always loved the song since the school assembly days. But just for tonight, I found the, the original one. I, I, about 20 years ago, I used to sing it in that kind of the traditional style. So this is the, a very traditional song, Amazing Grace, done in the real traditional style. <laughs>
Good evening, if you just tuned in, I'm looking on the figures and there's a, there's a, seems to be a few more eyes on there. I know people come on and they go off, but just a little bit mellow. Listen, if you do nod off while I'm singing, that's all right. You can listen again tomorrow if you want to. Just feel a bit mellow tonight, you know, just. Do you feel that? Do you feel that? Are you worried? You know? Hmm. Anyway, I don't really want to. Yeah, um, so let's, let's do another night. Let's do another. So we all know that, don't we? I think that's a. I think we would have done that in our school assemblies. How old is that song? Because my nan and granddad would have known that, so that must make it really, you know, quite old. So I wonder, I wonder who wrote that. I don't know anything about it. Let's just have a little look on a couple of comments. Let's just see. Let's see what, you, what you're feeling tonight. Um, hang on. Oh, it doesn't recognise me with my glasses on. <laughs> Nor do I, in fairness. I don't recognise me with my glasses on. So good evening to... Uh, who we got? Sarah's. Hello, Sarah. Uh, Michael's with us. Julie. Uh, Perriam. Uh, Bill's on. John. Uh, what's he sing? I would come and ask you to sing and hear you singing. Oh, how lovely. Oh, thank you, John. That's that's nice. Uh, Dee uh, Tennity. Evening from Scotland. Hello there. Um, Nicola Miller. Kathleen's on. Uh, Nicola. Jane Brazil. Oh, hello, Jane. How are you? I saw some of your posts. Uh, we was listening to the radio man. Uh, Kira's with us tonight. And thank you for my picture, Kira. Um, a young girl I know who comes to some shows and that just done a little picture of me, just like a mimic of, of a copy of this, and it just blew me away. That did I've put it on my wall? It's so nice that someone could do that. You know, <laughs> people say, "Oh, you play guitar? How do you do it?" But it's just something I've learned to do. But when someone can draw, I can't draw f you know, at, at all. I just find that amazing. It's really good. Um, so that's nice. Simon's on. Doreen, uh, Janet Tilson, uh, Chris Flavin. Um, Carol Dupree, hello, Kathleen's on. Turn the volume up, it's a little bit quiet. Turn your volume up. Uh, Lisa Johnston, Michael Norrington. Because I'm oh, sorry, who wrote that? John Newton wrote Amazing Grace. I didn't know that. I'll sing a little bit louder, okay, I'll go a little bit. I'm just not feeling very loud and lively. Normally we get all going, like crazy. I've actually just got, I've just got me, it's just a Red Bull there. I've, even, I've got no vodka in it tonight. Normally I've drunk three of them by now. So you might get to see me sing a couple of other songs. What about, let's, let's sing The Green Grass of Home. This is a classic song from, um, from Tom Jones and other people had hits as well, but we associate Tom Jones and Elvis did a great version. This is his style. <laughs> the old hometown looks the same Step down from the train There to meet me It's my mama And my papa And down the lane I look and There runs me Hair of gold And lips like cherries It's so good To touch green Green grass on oh. Yes I've come to see me Their arms reaching Smiling so sweetly Oh it's good To touch The green grass My old house, it's still standing Even though the paint's a little cracked and dry There's the old oak tree The one that I used to play on And down the lane I look There runs Mary Hair of gold Yes, and lips like cherry. It's so good to touch green grass. Home. You can sing along, you know. Just, just sing. Yes, and I'll come to see me. Beneath the old oak tree, it's so good to touch the green, green grass. Home. It's a talking bit now, you know that? 
Oh yes, and I awake and look around. You know, look at all. At the four gray walls that surround me, and I realize. I was only sleeping. For if there's a God, and a sad old palm an arm and arm, we're gonna walk a day breeze. And again, I'll teach green, green grass home. Yes, they're long. Arms reaching, smiling sweetly. It's so good to touch the green, green grass at home. Almost heaven. West Virginia, the Blue Ridge Mountains, Shenandoah River. Life feels older, older than the trees. It's younger than the mountains. It's growing like a breeze. It's the country roads take me home. I belong, West Virginia, Mountain Mama. Take me home, country road. All my memories gather round her. She's a miner's lady, stranger to the water, dark and dusty. Painted on the sky, a misty taste of moonshine, clear drop in my eyes. Country roads take me home to the place I belong. West Virginia, Mountain Mama, oh Mama, take me home. Country roads. Hear a voice in the morning as she calls me. The radio reminds me of my home, so far away. And I'm driving down the road. I get the feeling I should have been home yesterday. Yesterday, the country roads take me home back to the place. I belong, West Virginia, Mountain Mama, taking me home. Country roads, you sing. Country roads, take me home to the place I belong. West Virginia, Mountain Mama. Take me home, country roads. We've done that a few times before, but I've never got bored of that song, and it always gets it always gets asked, you know. So I'm going to sing you a song now. This is this is a first for the Sofa Show. This is. Um, I did an album some years ago with just me singing with a piano, and I've done a few songs off it. I've, I don't do them at normal gigs, but doing this, some people have asked, and I've kind of, I'm, I'm, I'm almost a bit braver when I'm here. I get very nervous about the piano and I just do. Um, so this is just on the track, the piano. I can't play it uh, and sing it like that. That would be too much for my, for my little head. But this is a song called When the Thought of You Catches Up With Me. It's really good. And the idea behind this song, and we can all relate to this, is that uh, you can go out with somebody or have something in your life and it's been gone for years and years and then suddenly you think about it again. You might be somewhere... Um, and something will remind you of it. And it might be a colour or a song or a smell. And then you can be straight back. Wherever it is, it might be something when you was young or an old relationship. And you can, you're straight back there, different things. 
So that's the idea, but it's just a great song. It's a David Ball song. There we are. That's that's the, the technicals out of the way. David Ball wrote the song. Um, and there's a very good friend of mine called Fergal, Fergal Flaherty, and he uh, he's he sit, or owns the, the Hole in the Wall bar in our, in Tenerife, and they're obviously not open at the moment. And he does a, I think it's a nightly live that he does. And I saw him do this first. Uh, we was up in Pontins at Pakefield, and he was with his band. This was... 20 years ago and he sang it and it just I thought it was so good and he was so good and we became friends after that and back then when you couldn't buy backing tracks you couldn't get tracks anywhere he kindly gave me the actual backing track and the band that he used to do that was Daniel O'Donnell's band like pretty much the players out of that and it had this lovely perfect middle of the road nothing was heavy it was easy listening and, I, and I've still got that album it's such a good CD I played him a lot on the radio through them years and um and then he obviously went to Tenerife and he, and he does his thing over there. But that, and I always remember that he gave me a track of the band. Tra backing tracks were rubbish back then. And that was my best one. And it went on my little mini disc. The singers would understand that. But So I'll sing it for you now. And I liked it from back then. So it, that's why it made it onto this CD. And uh, I think we can relate to this, you know. Often it's about um, an ex partner, is it a woman or you know, a man, whatever, way, whatever gender you are. And you hear something and you, <laughs> you're well up sometimes. <laughs> It can happen any moment Without reason or rhyme It might be right around the corner Or it'll come up from behind It's you that I thought would fade But I still clearly see When the thought of you catches up with me, it can happen on a Sunday drive, the sky above, a shade of blue, heading down some lonesome highway, and you come in. To And a picture that I thought would fade But I still clearly see Just when the thought of you catches up with me piano player on that is a young man called Scott Newstead and he lives in Suffolk in the UK and he's an exceptional piano player and we did that album over a couple of sessions he put the tracks down played the piano in a couple of bedrooms uh, in his house and I was in one room singing and the wire went through the door <laughs> you know it's just how it is and he, and he played great piano and I went around had a couple of drinks and we was up quite late and we sang it and it was just and that, and that was the end result and an album like that so 
Uh, and that's how I got to know that song from my mate Fergal all them years ago. And uh, I don't think I've got that backing track now. I don't know. It's on a mini disc. I don't think we have that now. So good evening to you. It's half past ten. Just singing a few mellow songs tonight. All right. I don't feel my usual funny jolly. So it won't know. It'll be a bit mellow, will it? You know, give my liver a rest. <laughs> so let's do this one, shall we? This, this is a song. If you're a country fan, you'll know these songs. But if you're not a big country fan, you, you, you might not know these songs. But because they're, they're still good songs. This one, the C M A Song of the Year. I think it was about ninety two, ninety three, from memory, from a man called Randy Travis. And the song, this is just a very clever song. It's called Three Wooden Crosses. And the story is about that the, there's, a, there's a coach accident and there's three wooden crosses, but somebody's t singing the song. So you're hearing the song being sung, but you don't realise who's singing the song until the end. But they obviously know about it. You're not sure whether they were the driver or were they there, or is it one of the people that's spoken about it. But at the end, it's, <laughs> it's, it's like when you watch a film. When you watch a film sometimes, and at the end you go... Oh, that was it. You kind of get that just in a song. And at the end, you go, oh, yeah. Yeah, I understand that. Yeah. <laughs> and it rightly, rightly so won the, won the song of the year. It's from um, Randy Travis, Three Wooden Crosses. Farmer and a teacher Hooker and a preacher Riding on a midtown bus Bound for Mexico One was heading for vacation One for higher education And two of them were searching For lost souls They drive and never ever saw The stop sign An eighteen-wheeler can Stop on a dime Now there's Three wooden crosses On the right side Of the highway Why there's not three of them But heaven only knows I guess it's Not what you take When you leave this world Behind you It's what you leave behind you When you go you know the farmer left his harvest Home on 80 acres Faith and love for growing things Within his young son's heart The teacher left her wisdom In the hearts of all those children He did their best to give them a better start And the preacher whispered Can't you see the promised land as he laid his blood-stained Bible in that hook his hand Three wooden crosses on the right side of the highway Why there's not four of them, heaven only knows I guess it's not what you take when you leave this world behind you It's what you leave behind you when you go that's the story that our preacher told last Sunday As he held that blood-stained Bible up for all of us to see he said, bless the farmer, bless the teacher, yeah, the preacher he Gave this Bible to my mama, she read it to me and Now there's three Crosses on the right side of the highway. Why there's not four of them, heaven only knows. I guess it's not what you take when you leave this world behind you. It's what we leave behind you when you go. Three wooden crosses on the right side of the highway. the preacher and the preacher gave the hook of the bible and she gave birth to the son and the son was at church got it <laughs> is this getting you into country music i don't know i don't know 
Yeah. What about this? Is from Christopher. We'll sing one. This is a bit of a pop. It's a very uh, nice mellow song. It's a, it's, I suppose it's a pop one. I think this would have come out in about. I don't know. I could be wrong. 1986, 1987, maybe for a man called Christopher. This song and Lady in Red. I don't know any of his other songs. I mean, they got Lady in Red. It's just legendary, isn't it? But it's a bit high for me that. I got the roses and I got the wine But the little luck, she's gonna be here on time Says a place he used to go the Romantic music, the lights down low You stand there amazed at the door And you wondering, what's all this for? It's just a simple thing Woman that I adore Something that you should know And it's that I've been missing you More than I can say Let me go There is no reason The things that we do You can break a heart With a word or two Take a lifetime to apologize To the one that you love In front of your eyes Fall to my knees like a fool If that's the only way That I can get if I think that you're beautiful, someone else, they might think it too. It's the only one thing to do. I see now, now that I found you, I'm in a letting go. Now that I found you, I'm never letting go. Welcome to the Sofa Show with me, Steve Sherrell. And this crazy world that we now live in. Nice to have you with me. You sitting on your sofa or are you in bed? Frederick's on. Gemma Playford, Yvonne's with us. Hello, Yvonne. Uh, Paul is on as well. Lynn Saunders. Hello, Lynn Saunders. Uh, we've got Yvonne, Annie Humphrey. Hello, Gary Haynes. Karen Bradshaw. Hello, Karen. Talked to Mark Wright about you the other day. Alison Goodall. Zoe Tuskin. I was born in 1987. Why did you tell me that? Oh, was that the year it came out? Okay. Yes. Yes. Rita, have you seen it? One, did, you, did you clock the cat, did you? I didn't say anything because he, he's got down there, see? He was just sat on the end. That's the black, That's the old one. He's about 20 years. He's not the happiest of people, but he's all right. Yeah, he's there. I don't know if you could see it on the camera. Uh, Michelle's on. Darcy Ann. Can't help singing along. That's the idea, Darcy. That is the absolute idea. Darcy's over in the USA. I take it you've heard about our Prime Minister. 
So we're just having a bit of a mellow one tonight, just just singing a few mellow songs. Uh, Diane, who we got here? Rita, but yeah, I, I saw, I watched you today, Rita. Good, 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 good. Setting up, you know, so it's a bit of messing around, but we get there, don't we? Um, Colleen Jeery's there, Mary Davis, uh, Annie Humphrey, Jean Gordon, I think we've got Ro Roly. Oh, hello, Roly. How are you, mate? Are you well? Are you, you coping with it all? Ellie Finnegan, watch her. Nice to see you with us. Uh, Jamie Daly's on. Colleen Jeery. Uh, Joanne, it looks like the cat likes it too. So you've all said, I don't even want to say it. Yeah. One day, maybe in about 10 years, they'll all sit up here. I rarely see that one. I mean, I've got two young ones, and they're, um, they're great fun. But that, I don't see him a lot. He's Toby. I've had him for 16 years now. He's just sat there looking at me. Like, he's looking at me like I'm a weirdo. He's thinking, why are you wearing a hat and sitting like that? <laughs> he's used to me laying down. Uh, Anne Shannon is watching. That's nice. Uh, Tracy Batham. Joe. Um, oh, Joe. It's nice that you're there, Joe. Thank you. That's nice. Um, I haven't put the tip, tip jar up tonight. I thought I'd leave the tip. I just fancied singing you a few songs, you know. But we, we do this. If you don't know, I do a little show every night at 10. Lots of people do stuff in the day because they're busy with other things. So there's lots of that. And I don't want to crowd that space. I like the evenings a bit better. So no one does anything late. Or the, or certainly not as late as I go on. I know that. Because when I come off, I look and everyone's in bed. <laughs> the latest people stay up with me. So... um. So let's look at that. So I'm just finding some lovely, just finding some lovely mellow songs. And wasn't that nice? The Krista Burr song. Is it 33 years old? Ah, because she was born in 87. 97? 7, 17. That, yeah, sorry. I'm quite good at maths, but obviously not, not at that moment there. <laughs> this is a song called So It Goes. It's a good song, this is. This is about everything, everything fades and rusts and breaks and falls over and ends and gets destroyed apart from love that is the simple little sentiment in this song imagine on a hill that's a lovely sight to see but like any other house it's only temporary home as anywhere you choose to put your heart there's no love inside well it'll soon fall apart so ash is to ashes and dust into dust buildings will crumble and bridges will rust and mountains Disappear and rivers will dry up. So it goes with everything in love. He who drive around a big limousine knows what it means. Be a wealthy thing He who'd walk a mile Just to hold an empty hand He knows how it feels To be a wealthy man And ashes to ashes And dust into dust Will crumble Rivers will dry up So it goes with everything in love The worldly treasure Is all gonna pass away But there's just one thing That's been put in a stay Ashes to ashes, dust into dust. The kingdoms will crumble, the bridges will rust. Mountains will disappear, rivers will dry up. So it goes with everything that love. 
So it goes with everything we love. So it goes with everything we love. I've got that itchy nose, Pat. I've got that itchy nose. I'm going to sing Sending the I'm going to sing Sending the Clowns and we're going to do I think we'll do oh we we'll do we we'll do this song next I tell you, this is um because we do just a little bit of mellow songs and some of the mellow songs I know they have, they have a little bit of a a god like religious not religious what's the word they've got a little bit of you know a bit of the lord in them like amazing grace and the three wooden crosses and this one that I'll sing now and I'll sing this for Kirsty because I know this is her favorite and this is um it's a Garth Brooks song I sang it for the first time last night in about 10 years, but in case you missed it, and I, I like to tell you a little bit behind the song. I love that about the songs, and then and when you hear it, it should make sense for you. And this is called Unanswered Prayers, and it's about when we pray for things, as we often do, don't we? Often it's when we need something, you know, please don't, please don't um, find out about that, or whatever it is, get sacked, or blah, whatever it is. And um, I think there's probably a lot of that going on around the world, isn't there? Probably, yeah, and people in their desperation, but... But we ask for things and we don't always get them. You might not get that job. You might not get that car or win that bet or whatever it is or get the girl. And that's what this bit of the song's about. This is about not getting the girl. And the song is called Unanswered Prayers. And sometimes the gift is in the unanswered prayer. And not getting what you ask for is the best thing. But you don't always see that. You don't always see that at the time, do you? See? So if you've heard this, you'll know what I'm going on about. But if you're not, you're thinking, that's very well explained, Mr. Sherell like to hear that song now. Just the other night, a hometown football game, my wife and I ran into my old high school friend, and as I introduced them, all the past came back to me. And I couldn't help but think of the way things used to be. She was the one that I wanted for all time. And each night I'd spend praying that God would make her run. And if He'd only grant me this wish I wished back then, well, I'd never ask. Anything again. Sometimes I thank God for the honest praise and remember when you're talking to that man upstairs. But just because he don't answer doesn't mean he don't care. The Son of God's greatest gift of the unanswered prayer. She wasn't quite the angel I remembered in my dream. I could see the time it changed me in her eyes to the sea. We tried to talk about the old days there wasn't much that I could recall. I guess the Lord knows what is doing after all. As I walked away and I looked at my wife, then and there I thank the good Lord for all the gifts in my life. Sometimes you should just thank God for the unanswered prayer. And remember when you're talking to that man upstairs. But just because he doesn't answer doesn't mean he don't care. Some of God's greatest gifts are unanswered. Some of God's greatest gifts are too often the unanswered. 
some of God's greatest gifts, those unanswered prayers. song isn't described i used to sing that years ago and as we got this lockdown and lots of time i'm rummaging through lists and i'm trying to find some old songs that, that i used to do uh, like that like that one like that one how what we got here uh let's leave that for what's the time now so look, we get we're getting up to 11 o'clock then so i said i'd just come and sing would you like i'm i'm sort of right sitting here i don't i don't feel particularly tired i'm not drinking tonight just would you like to know let's have a look at Let's say hello to a few people. I think I might watch a film tonight. I haven't watched any telly for weeks, and I might just watch a film. Um, let's have a look down here. Uh, do you realise that we will all go down in history with how music lifted our spirits and got us through this terrible... Yeah, we will, won't we? That is terrible. We will. There's so much... I know that all the entertainment people, all our, all our work's gone, as it has for many people, but in a way there's so many of us that can do things like this and so many people are that's kind of a little bit of a blessing in disguise you know there's so many things trades that you can't do anything i've seen the chefs and the people that run kitchens and the people that got hotels doing things that they just do still cooking i saw a chef on the news the other day and he said i've just got to cook food he said i cook food i can't can't you know he's, he's an, i can't i'm not me if i'm not singing and he said i'm not me if i'm not cooking food and he was now cooking for the for homeless or people or elderly people that needed food and he was it was proper gourmet food and you just knew that he was putting this. He, did you see him cutting that yellow pepper? It was such skill. But he was putting the same amount of, you know, panache and style into this little meal that was going in a little metal tray, which you do, don't you? I mean, I try and sing as well on my sofa as I would, you know, if I was at Wembley. And um, it was just good to see that. So that they can direct it to a different avenue for a while. And hmm, if there's ever a silver lining on things. But yeah, music, we're, just, we're all learning so much more stuff, aren't we? And, and um, we just are learning about each other and ourselves i suppose so how do you feel about the thing that's happening with boris i don't they say that he's, he's still conscious and that so um i've lost a couple of people in that situation they've gone into that situation and then not come out and uh, that's my feeling when i saw that it just made me go cold and made me feel very sad because i remember that that's what if you've been in that situation it's kind of um it's a step in that direction and lots of people get well and it's a good thing but it's just the worry isn't it it's the worry for everybody and then um, I knew his wife had a baby on the way, but he's got four other kids, isn't he? There's <laughs> I mean, how does he do that? Four kids and a one on the way and doing this job. You know, it's a lot, isn't it? I know he gets driven. Yeah, he's got a car. He's got a driver. Of course, you know, you ain't got to change a flat tire or wallpaper the hall, but still a lot going on, isn't it? Right, so let's come back to this. Should we sit? What about singing? Uh, let's do... Oh, let's do Some Days of Diamonds and Some Days of Stone. This has been asked for so many times. On Wednesdays, I do a little request show. We start at 8 o'clock, and I'll just sing all requests. We've got about 25 so far. So just send me a message with a song. Most of them I can do. I'm learning a couple for it. Um, they're all kind of lovely songs at the moment, but that's all right. This one's I've had about 15 people request this already. Because <laughs> you like it, don't you? It was written by an Englishman called Dick Feller. Although it was John Denver, he had a number one with this pretty much everywhere. It's one of his big hits, this was. He didn't write this one. It was... Um, yeah, it was an English little folk singer. Let's sing it for you. About the good days and the bad days of life, eh? Not having so many good ones at the moment. Oh. When you ask, have I been without you? I'd like to say I've been fine. And I do But we both We know the truth It's hard to come by And if I Told the truth That's not quite true You should know the words You sing but Some days are diamonds And some days are stone Sometimes a hard times won't leave me alone. Sometimes the cold wind blows. 
was a chip in my bones. Oh, some days a time, some days a storm. the face I see in my mirror more and more is a stranger to me and more and more I can see is a danger in becoming but I never thought I'd be Some days a diamonds Some days a storm Sometimes a hard times You won't leave me alone Sometimes the cold wind blows the chill my bones, oh, and some days are diamonds, some days are storm. Some days are diamonds, some days they're storm. Sometimes a heart. Good show, good show, good show. If you just dropped by, if you just tuned in, hello there. It's, uh, it's just gone 11 o'clock on a, on a Monday. It is Monday today. Now, you get any days in the muddle? I think a few of us are, aren't we? Hey, this is a little song. I'd I like to share this with you. I got that's why I got Gruff up there because I got my little boy, and I think he might be watching the odd one of these. Hopefully, and it, well, it might. It's probably not. It's a bit late in it, but he could get it on. He hasn't got a Facebook account yet because he's only three and a half. Uh, he's a lovely little lad. He's a li little Theo. So I'm gonna. I wrote a little song for him when he came into the world. I had this little idea of a song, and he just talks about seeing him for the first time. I held him first. That's you know when he when he come along, <laughs> they plonked him in my hands. I was in the, I was in the room, and it was. It was overwhelming, I have to say. And I got the, the, I was very tired, but I got a great picture. The nurse kindly got a picture, and it's just one of the best picture. Sat there with the thing on, and uh, and he was there, and uh, and that's that. So anyway, so and I thought about you know the first day at school, the first job, the first girlfriend when he gets mad, and all those things, and the, and the start and the end. So I just come up with a little a little idea. <laughs> song called Hello Sun. Hello Sun, so good to see you smile, me and mum. We've been waiting quite a while, and here and now, the journey it's begun, I'll be here with you son. Hello Sun. Was your first day at school? Was it fun? Did you learn something new? And can you spell the words and figure out the sun? I am so proud of you, son. Hello, son. Was your first day at work? Was it hard? And do all those muscles hurt? Were they happy with you and all the work you done? Welcome home, my son. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hello, son. I 
was your first day tonight? Did you smile? Did you get those butterflies? Now are you going out again? You think she is the one? Hey, son. And hello, son. Tell me how's your broken heart? You know they men. You go right back to the start. Then you try and try again until your search is done. You're just like me, my son, like your old man, my son. Hello, son, hello, son. It's so good to watch you grow, making friends and a family of your own. Be true in what you do and live under the golden sun. That's my advice. Hello, son. So good to see you smile. Come sit down. Come and talk with me a while. Tell me all about your life and everything you've done. I want to know. How do you, son? I'd like to know about my son. I love you so. Mm-hmm. My son. years ago I would have had no idea who that is but I know that's gruff now <laughs> you get to you get to know things like that didn't you anyway let's uh let's let's sing a few more songs that was just one of me oh yeah I always get nervous when you sing your own songs because no one knows them and they might be sitting there going oh don't be done like that sing something we know <laughs> uh what's the are there any Elvis fans watching any Elvis fans or Jim Reeves actually they both did this I think I, th- I would I would say that Jim Reeves did it first that would be my uh we will oh let's have a look what's the um <laughs> oh, it's quite there's a lot of people tuned in which is nice thank you you're is it a little bit quiet it's a little bit quiet oh yes yeah, Scott is a legend oh it's a little bit quiet I just didn't want to be that loud really. I don't want to be thumping out but I suppose you need to hear it a bit more than it uh oh 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 <laughs> Tom's on. Hello, Tom. Welcome back. Dave Bryan's on. Uh, thanks for your phone message, Dave. Appreciate it, mate. I got that the other day. Janet Morgan. Uh, Bill, Bill's there. Uh, Kirsty Markham's watching. Hello, Kirsty. Mo Whittam. John Ashton, fellow singer-songwriter. John, uh, right up the other end of the country. Uh, Janice Went is there. Zed Buckley's on. All right, Zed. Joe Whiteley. Rosaline. Uh, Jean Cooper. Uh, oh, there we are. The little chat there. Um, good, 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 good. Uh, Graham's there, lovely. Gra- Hello, Graham. Uh, and Callum's on. Wendy Schwoish. I got your request for Wednesday. Uh, Sophie Aldridge. Gail Johnson. Uh, Kerry, I don't know why I'm doing that. What does that mean? Laura Laura Cleary's on. Your mate's on up. She's just a bit further up. Pat Stone. Dee Tennity. Uh, Vicky Taylor. Jane Brazil. Hi, Devlin. And Anne Rhodes. <laughs> Pat Stone's on. Zoe Davis. And lots of others there. 33 years ago that song came out. Yes, it did. You're right. That's when it came out. Well, look, we've got quite a few watching. So um, Jacqueline Godfrey's also on, and Andy Green, uh, and Karen Mid- Midwinter. Oh, thank you for saying that. Yeah, that's a ni- nice song, isn't it? You know, they, they come on. I wrote you a song years ago, didn't I? I seem to remember. <laughs> you do that when you're young, you know, you write songs. You just write these little, little You just do, don't you? You know, I don't write anymore. I got fed up with after about 20 of them, you know. Sort of gave up. No, no, no. <laughs> I should, though. I haven't been in love for a long time. Is there anybody in love that's watching the show tonight? So, by the way, I have love hearts. I'm going to prepare the next song. Who's in love tonight? Let's have a little look, see who it comes up. See if it's just because we've got about 75 people online. Quite a lot of you up tonight. And you've got homes to go to. Yeah, a bit of love coming through there. So we've got a few people up, more, probably more single people. See, all the lovers are in bed. All the lovers are in bed. You know, or the ones that ain't getting on, they're sitting up. One of them's in bed and one of them's watching me. My friend Kim in Basildon goes to bed um, with her husband about midnight and then she wonders whether I'm still on. And has a little, I found that out the other day. Oh, look, oh, there's a lot of love. Oh, blimey. Jim. Hello, hello, Jim. Hello, Jimmy. Oh, look, it's just me on my own then. Well, I'm single at the moment. I'm single, so... Uh, um, obviously, you're not going to want to live here because there's no room for you, basically. 
all the room's gone because it's taken up with a sofa show. But there we are. Trudy Allingham. Another half hour, then I need to go to bed for a 12-hour shift tomorrow. Oh, okay, Elizabeth. Well, enjoy what you can. If you can't watch it, you can catch up tomorrow. Susan Stanley. Um, I think that's I think that's the last. We've sort of caught up with most of the people. There's, oh, there's a lot There's a lot of romance. Is there really? Do you still do that, do you? Do you get up to that or not? No. Not at your age. Surely not. <laughs> I have a couple of purring cats that lay on my face in the morning. That's as close as I get to any kind of affection. And then they start laying. Of course, you know, I don't know if you know, follow my cats, but my cats are gay. I've got two male cats, and they are poofs, total gay, cuddling all the time. They follow each other around. I don't think they've met a female cat. I think that's going to happen, isn't it? One of them's going to go out and find a female cat and come back and say, here, Smokey, <laughs> get off. Look what I've found. It's all gonna, that's all going to change then, isn't it? Okay, let's sing you this. This is from um, Jim Reeves or Elvis Presley. <laughs> Heard your sweet lips a little closer to the phone And let's pretend that we're together, you and I all alone I'll tell the man to turn the jukebox way down low You can tell your friend there with you, he's got to go. You can't say the words I want to hear while you wait another man. Do you want me and see it so Darling, I'll understand Heard you sweet A little closer To the phone And let's pretend That we're together You and I all alone I'll tell the man Turn the cheap box way down low And you can tell your friend there with you He's got to go Together all alone, and I'm telling that man, turn the jukebox, turn it way down low. Tell the man who's there with you that he'll have to go. And tell. 
many with you but he's got to go you know I was just thinking then um, about that song I wrote all them years ago and I can remember it you know I did an album about 20 years ago called Wonderful Todays. And I put about, that's when I was brave then. I used to do half of my own songs and half covers. <laughs> and uh, I'll sing this for you. This, I think this was probably the first little love song I wrote. I was, how old was I? Goodness me. That, I, got, I remember I got my first flat. My first flat was in Westcliff. And uh, so I must have been 21, I think. I'd just come back from, we spoke about that the other night. That was a blue coat. Then I lived in Falaraki and that all went wonky because I turned into a bit of an alcoholic. And I come home and bought a flat. And... Uh, that was that was a lot of fun. That was a lot of good years they were. Oh, I'll have a go. This is it's called Staying Out. This is one of my early attempts at a love song. We stay out so late at night when we finally make it home. It's getting light. Both want to make love, but we're too tired. So we talk for a while and say goodnight. And fall asleep with you is just so fine. To see your face when I wake just seems right. And I know that I've known you just a while. Sure, we'll be together a long, long time. Feelings that I feel for you I never had before. I know sometimes I wonder, but deep down I think I'm sure. So tell me, you feel it too? As if you can, then what we have. Might be true. All of this I feel for you ain't known before. And yes, sometimes I wonder, but I also know I'm sure. Tell me, do you feel this too? Because if you can, then what we have, I hope what we have is true. Very, very early love song. And obviously all them feelings were very, very real at the time. And then we broke up. So there you are. So the song come along, and I've probably got two or three of them there. Uh, and they're really good, and you really think it, don't you? You know, you you get with these people, and um, you love them, and they're real nice, and you think I'm going to be with you forever. You know, <laughs> it's not until you get older. I mean, sometimes, let's face it, sometimes, like one in every about four hundred years, someone does stay together. But for the most part, we don't, do we? And um, and it's nice. And the person that I wrote that for is is watching the show tonight. Isn't that lovely? You know, and I'm not bitter. You know, she left me, but it's all right. I've dealt with it. I'm over it. All right. Still owe me 15 quid, though. I'll bear that in mind. Steve's watching. Wendy Smith tuned in. Deb, Deb, thank you for my little drink last night. Deb got me a little drink last night. <laughs> oh, that's nice, Karen. Nice hearts, not broken hearts. <laughs> Do you remember that? Her number, oh, t- her number plate was fart. It was F-A-R, a couple of numbers, and T. It was an orange, it was an orange Cortina. It was, it, was a, was it, it was orange, wasn't it? It was the, the, the equivalent mini would have been Mr. Bean's mini. It was. It had, I'm sure it had brown velvet seats. It was like a porn mobile. It was all right. Though. It was quite a luxurious thing. I, I, I think I had an XR2 at the time, or a big Rover, a, a big V8, what the police used to drive. But the car number plate was far. I mean, you should have. There should have been a warning sign there, really. Uh, my mum, God rest her soul's favourite was the Jim Reeves song, Richard. Ah, yeah. And you done that song for your mum, didn't you? <laughs> nice, nice. Ian Walton tuned in. Carla Hutchinson. Paul Wood. Richard's with us, Tiffany and Carla, uh, Sophie, Susan. Ah, oh, that's nice, yeah. Listen, if you missed this, just just listen again, okay? I'm just a bit mellow tonight, you know. I really, really felt quite 
sad. And I know I'm not taking anything away from uh, all the people that we've lost, because we have, and the closeness that what what it's just devastating, isn't it? The whole thing is devastating. However, I tried to explain this to someone today. We see a figure on the TV, yet we don't see the people, do we? And unless we know them, you can't feel you can't feel something that's not there because you don't know the person. However, and I know we don't know Boris as such, but when somebody comes on and they put a face to that person, suppose it's I saw a guy in there and he recovered this guy and he was ever so old. Well, he was about forty. And what, but once you see them on the telly talking or you see some photographs or where they live, you kind of, you, you build a connection. So if there is somebody featured on the news and we see them over a few nights and then they, they pass away, it's kind of, it's, it's sad then, isn't it? Because you think, oh, that woman, did you see that lady or that man that was on there, the bus driver or, the, or one of the nurses, you know, the two nurses we lost a few days ago. We saw their picture and a little bit about them. And you just, it's, it's more emotional because then the person becomes realer to you. I don't know if real is an actual word, but they become more real to you because you, you know about them. And that's the, that's the difference, I think. And so we've kind of, we've all got to know Boris a little bit. We've seen him under pressure, and I, I like the bloke. I just think he's all right, and that's it, because he's just a bit of a real bloke. That's why I like him. He doesn't care about his suit and his tie and his hair. He isn't preoccupied doing his makeup. He just gets out and starts talking. That's why I like him. And I, th you know, and I just think, you know, it shouldn't be all show. There's been a few of them all just showy, and I don't like that. Um, anyway, that, that's just my personal views in it. So, um, yeah, so just I thought I'd just sing a few mellow songs. I'm, like, you can see I'm not even drinking. My, my complete mood has completely just just changed. And I spoke to one of my friends who was all upset. We spoke about it a little bit. She, you know, it's just um, as we're all talking about it. I've turned the telly off because I didn't want to be distracted by it. But I hope we don't get any tragic news. Wouldn't it be great if he, you know, if he gets strong and well and comes out? He would be an absolute... An advocate that we, you know, that y that you can, you can pull through, you know, um, and nobody would understand it more than him, then would he? That you know, if if that if he goes through this whole process, more than any, any more than most of us, he would have lived it, you know. And who better to kind of be at the forefront than someone that's gone through it, you know? Because then, anyway, I'm not putting my cowboy out on tonight. So, oh, I want to sing you this song. We've done this. I saw my mate John done this the other day. And then um, Sarah Louise did it yesterday. I gave her a little guitar lesson in the morning. She sang it. I sang it last night. So I've only, I've only done it a couple of times. It's called Humble and Kind. That's the name of the song. Very appropriate song for the way, you know, things, are, all the little bits that we get going up on Facebook and that. Um, I've got a glance at the lyric because I, I don't know the words too well. So t Tim McGraw tune this is. <laughs> Good advice. There's a light that shines by the front porch. Don't forget the keys under the mat. Childhood stars shine. So always the humble to kind. Go to church cause your mama says to Visit grandpa, there's a chance that you can It won't be a waste of time If you always stay humble and kind Hold the door, say please and say thank you Don't you steal and don't cheat and don't lie I know you got mountains to climb Always the humble and kind When the dreams that you're dreaming come to you When the work you've put in is realized Let yourself feel the pride Always the humble and kind Don't expect a free word from no one Hold a grudge or a chip Here's why Bitterness stops you from flying So always Stay humble and kind Oh the difference Between sleeping with someone And sleeping with someone you love I love you's not an old pickup line So always Stay humble and kind Hold the door, say please, 
say thank you Cause you're stealing, don't cheat and don't lie I know you've got mountains to climb And always stay humble and kind And when the dreams that you dream and come to you And when the work that you've done's realized Let yourself feel the pride But stay humble and kind When it's hot, drink a beer and a popsicle Shut off the AC and roll the windows down Let that summer shine in Always stay humble and kind Don't for granted the love that life gives you When you get where you're going, turn back round Help the next one in line Always the humble and kind It's not nice, isn't it? Getting to really know that. That's great when you when you learn a song, you have to look at the lyric and check it, you're thinking, but then once you know it all, you can you get into it and you can really sing it for yourself. If there's any singers watching, good evening to you. Are you doing any Facebook lives? We've got the big country club that happens on a Tuesday and a Sunday. I think they might be doing a bit on a Saturday now as well at the UK Country Music Live, which is good. They've got five, well, probably nearly 6,000 members now. I haven't caught up on it today. So I'm going to sing you a couple of more songs, and I'm going to make a cup of tea, and I think I'm going to, well, I was going to put the telly on and see what's going on. So um, cheers for your company. I didn't put the tip jar up tonight. I mean, it's nice if you want to tip me, but I just was, it wasn't me feeling it. So we'll do tomorrow. I mean, obviously things could change in that, so maybe... Well, ju let's just see what happens. That's that's all we can do in it. But I've just a little bit mellow tonight. We had we've had some great nights, haven't we? And what we're doing is I record these, and my friend Graham, because he's very good at that, he puts it on my YouTube channel. If you want to subscribe to that, so this shows then on there, so you can watch it sort of when you want. Because Facebook sort of rolls down the page, doesn't it? And we've got a, there's a few other bits on there over the years. Just and I've got about 25 followers now, which I'm really happy with. But then when I look on there, and you'll see something like crocodiles eating pigeons and there's like 15 million followers for the man that puts that on there but you know horses for courses <laughs> and i do like watching all that you know i look at things that i like like what i love the wildlife the african wildlife and following the story of a pride of lions it's completely it's so far away from anything musical or country it's just mad but when i'm on my and what I've learned with my YouTube is that when you watch a video, the little red line goes along the bottom, doesn't it? So you know how far you've got. And um, I watch it, and then I'll go back and I'll put in something I'm searching, and they've all been watched. I mean, I'm going to run out. I'm going to run out of stuff to watch. <laughs> this has got a little bit of a, a little bit of a, you know, the Lord feel about it. Get ready for the train coming. Don't need no baggage, just get on board. You need his faith to hear the diesel humming. You don't need a ticket, you just thank the Lord. Get ready for the train to Jordan. It's picking up passengers from coast to coast. 
Faith is the key, it opens the doors and the borders. There's room for all among the loving Lord. Ain't no room for the hopeless sinner Heard all mankind to save his own Have pity on those whose choices grow thinner There's no hiding place from the king on the strong People get ready, dream coming Need no baggage, you just get on board. All you need is faith to hear those diesels humming. You don't need no ticket, just thank the Lord. that Nina Simone recorded that many, many years ago. Nina Simone. Well, look, it's half 11, so we've done a little half an hour encore tonight. Are you glad you stopped by? I had a bit of fish today. I had fish in parsley sauce with veg. That's the most healthy thing I've had in my life, probably. Funny, isn't it? That made me laugh there. I'm having, I'm having my own little chuckle here. Where the rivers are gliding and trees their leaves are turning. Hey, hey, we went. <laughs> I'm just thinking of a couple of more songs I could sing you. Just as we, we wrap up. We, might, we know what the last one's going to be, don't we, Victoria? Let's see who's on. Let's say good evening. So we've got, oh, we got 50 on. So we've got 50 people. That's lovely, isn't it? If that was a gig, I'd be really happy with that, wasn't it? If that, this was a little gap, you all come around here. Don't go, Steve. The show must go on. A sunshine on my shoulders. Steve Jay's watching. Andy, Arizona. Where have you been, mate? You're late. Late as usual. Been a while since I heard this. A beautiful song. Uh, get well. Get well, Boris. Yes. Get well, Boris. Um, Alison Goodall's tuned in. Sunshine on my shoulders. <laughs> okay. Sunshine on my shoulders because it's a guitar song and we need to do a few more then. Margaret Goring's tuned in. Lorna Lancaster. Les Spicer. My old mate Les. I used to go to Spalding 20 years ago. That was a bloody long drive. And Les would put me up in his house and I'd sing in his club. Really, I used to love that gig. God, it's a long way, long way now, eh, Les? Do you remember that? Remember what we used to do with all the car tax discs? Yeah, he was a car dealer, and we used to get the taxis. We'd get the taxis, and we'd send them all back. Do you remember? <laughs> we, had a, we had a little scam going. It wasn't illegal. It was just a little thing we used to do, and it's funny, wasn't it? We used to look forward to that. Um, Susan Hickson. Good night, you. Good night, Susan. That's how You sleep well. Good night, Steve. Thank you. I like that you say the night, even if you don't see it when I'm there. Uh, Rod Stewart. Um, Rocky Mountain High, please. Let's put them on. I don't do sailing. Put it, put it over to the request thing, because we're not doing that. See you, Steve. Uh, tip me on. Oh, that's nice. If you want to tip me on Wednesday. Jay Bellamy's. Jay, you're there. Are you still there, Jay? If you are, I'll sing you leaving on a jet plane. Billy Robinson's tuning. Hello, mate. Uh, 
Uh, great music as always. Thanks for singing to us. Night, Steve and friends. Good night and thank you very much. No night, Steve. Catch up with the rest of the show tomorrow from Nicola Miller. That's nice, isn't it? People saying the night. Manners, see? We're doing well, aren't we? We're doing well, us. Are you still there, Jay? Let me know if you're there and I'll sing you a tune. So you want um, Sunshine on My Shoulders. Uh, it's been requested. We'll si All right, we'll sing that. I did it outside the other day, didn't I? It was funny singing that outside. I, I, I got this thing called a I pocket thing, a little recorder, and I went out there to do it. There's some great outtakes because I've sung it once and it goes wrong, and then I, I cough and I need to clear my throat. Then you do it, then the guitar bit goes wrong. Then you start thinking about it too much when you're trying to record something, and it gets all in the muddle. And then some people walk past, and there was a dog barking. And where I am, there's a tractor. There's a tractor guy over there. And I got about halfway through it, and then the tractor went past. Well, the things I called in, and it just went on and on, you know, <laughs> trying to get it eventually. And I could hear the tractor in the distance, just as I was getting to the end, and I'm concentrating on it, thinking, please don't come this way. And we got we got one. And there was some wind, and there was the wind was blowing. So now I've got to wipe my old Tupperware dishes, cut it all out, and put old gaffer tape around it, and that goes around it like a big bowl. You know, so I was chopping it's like being on Blue Peter when I'm here, gonna get an idea in my head. <laughs> Sunshine on my shoulders. How could I not sing this? Sunshine on my shoulders, it makes me happy. Sunshine. In my eyes, it makes me cry. And sunshine on the water, it looks so lovely. And sunshine almost all the time makes me high. If I had a tale that I could tell you I'd tell a tale, sure, to make you smile and If I had a wish that I could wish for you I'd make a wish for sunshine all the while. And sunshine on my shoulder makes me happy. And sunshine in my eyes makes me cry. My night, Karen. Sunshine on the water looks so lovely. Ooh, and sunshine almost all the time makes me high. And sunshine almost all the time makes me high. a nice request thank you for asking for that i've sung i see i've sung that a few times this week and i thought you'd be i thought you'd be bored of that tom i did stand by me right at the start tom so if you if you go to the start of the program you can watch it it'll be on youtube tomorrow i'll put it on there pamela nichols sheila fink cheers stevie andrew adrian freeman and the night to you karen uh, you and yours and i hope you're doing okay where you are i mean you live in a great part of the world down in south end but can't go and enjoy you know the beach and that on the on the sunny days but Get in the garden. Do the jobs around the house that you can do. So listen, thanks everybody for your company. Uh, thank you for being with us tonight. I'm going to sing you one more song, and then I'm going to I'm going to leave it. And I'm going to sit. I'm going to have a little bit of quiet time myself. You know that I'm I'm going to put a bit of news, and I'd like to get an update on what's going on with with our friend Boris. Going to make a cup of tea. I've had no booze tonight. Let's fill up that. What a waste! That's, that's a whole can of Red Bull. I get told off when I sing. Everyone says that's bad for you, and, and I know it is. Most of what I eat is bad for me. Although, like I said, I had bit of cod in parsley sauce today. I had, what were them orange things? They were orange, carrots. I had, they was on there. And pe I love peas. 
I love peas. But you get peas in um, special fried rice, don't you? So, Well, look, cheers all. So let's, uh, let's have a little look here. Hang on a minute. One sec, one sec. I, li I like to end the show properly. You know that. You should know this about me there. Da -da -da -da. Let's... Mm. There's the one I want. See, I like to say good evening properly and good night. I suppose it's 30 years of doing gigs. We just get used to it, don't we? Call the area. Oh, area. This is it. So I've, we've been doing these a little while. And there's a, li there's a little song that I always like to end with. I just had to find it there. And um, again, I don't know how old this one is. Someone, on, someone that's listening will know. They'll be able to tell. It's probably 40s or 50s, maybe. Old. It's called You Are My Sunshine. And it's a great little kind of, it's got a little, da, 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 da. So it's a good it's a good track, it's a good lively little finger picking track. I just want to check Jay's not there, because if you, no, oh, Ollie, oh, Ollie's there, hello, Ollie. Oh, sorry, Olivia, sorry. Jim, no, night, mate, see you later, Jimmy. Take it easy, boy, and I'll see you tomorrow. I can't see what that says there. Uh, I need my glasses. Thanks, Steve. Uh, hang on, hang, let me look at this. Hang on a moment. This is good. Carol Thompson says, hi, so thanks, Steve. Ron Matthews will be starting his show at midnight. John Denver songs. Be a late one for me. See you see you tomorrow at 10. Yeah, you'll see me tomorrow at 10. Is he? Right, I might have a look at that. Well, I'm going to have a mellow. Go. I could find it tomorrow. I was thinking of doing a John Denver show, like the show that I do on the road, on the tours. I could do it on the sofa. Do an hour of me John Denver songs, because I know there's a lot of fans around the world that tune in. So I'll have a little go at that. Leslie, I know you've been having some great nights, so no night to you. Sleep well. Uh, Carol, Anne Rhodes, uh, Tiffany, Tricia, Kazu As Asa is watching Jane Brazil. Thanks. Thanks, Jane. How's Pete doing? It's funny that Pete's sort of retired or is retiring on a time when when it's sort of being done for him, isn't it? You know, so it's um, this was the last year, was it? This was going to be your last sort of run of gigs. And then, well, it was, you were going to have a year off. I know that. So that's kind of. <sighs> maybe you should postpone it to next year then, Jane, in light of sort of what's happened. So. <laughs> if you want to come and do Walders, that would be nice. You'll be missing it by then. See, now we've been forced to stop and we can't sing. It's been a little while, and then, you know, maybe, maybe you'll come back and see how it goes. Everything's different now, isn't it? You know? And I've got something coming up. I, I might have to count. They might have to count. I think it will. It's one of the big events we do. I was talking to my friend John today, and he's got a few that he's had to stop and just trying to shuffle it and make them next year, you know? Um, I like the word postpone. I think that's a much better word than cancel. Just we're going to postpone. Everything's on hold. Hold, so we're going to postpone the holiday and we'll postpone that. We'll figure it out. Just give us a bit. We'll do it later. It's the best, best way to look at it, isn't it? Can't get it all done now. So, look, cheers, everybody. It's nice to have some friends on there. I'm slowly getting to know your names. I'll be with you at 10 o'clock tomorrow. Uh, and we wish, we wish our Prime Minister well. Um, and let's see what happens. But thanks for chilling out with me for a little while. Do you prefer it like this? <laughs> I don't think I'm going to have the smoke in it. I like the smoke. We have a laugh. We put the smoke and put the lights on. You do the little late bar. But I mean, normally this wouldn't even be halfway through, would it? Goodness. But it's like a late bar, Jane. Like when we have a late bar at Gunton or somewhere. One of those places. Anyway, take care of yourselves. And uh, oh, I sound like a <laughs> sound like that chat show host and each other. I'll leave you with this. This is for the nans and granddads. All of them. Wherever they are. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You sing. You make me happy when skies are gray. You'll never know dear how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. The other night, dear, while I was sleeping, I dreamed I held you in my arms. But when I woke, dear, I was mistaken. So I hang my head and I cried. I'll always love you. You make me happy. And I wish you felt the same But if you leave me And love another You'll regret it all someday You 
are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when stars are gray. You never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. Oh, please don't take my sunshine away. Thanks for your company tonight. Please don't take my sunshine away. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Sleep tight. I'll see you tomorrow, 10 p.m. That's what you call an encore. So, to those people that have gone, they're going to miss this now, aren't they? Because they have got no idea that I've come back and I'm going to sing a couple more songs. To those of you that are a little bit mad, because when I was out there, there were still 40 people listening. You nutters. I said goodnight and said I was going. And you've stayed, just looking at an empty room. <laughs> and normally when I go, I go. What are you like? Hey, could you feel it? Could you feel I was going to come and do a couple more songs? For you? Keep it with the, the Lord feel. Spend all 
all your time waiting for a second chance. I pray that it make it okay. There's always some reason to feel not good enough. And it's hard at the end of the day. I need some distraction. Oh, beautiful. Memory received from my veins. I may be empty or weightless, maybe find some peace tonight in the arms of the angel far away. From this dark hotel room In the endlessness that you feel And I am pulled from the wreckage Of your silent reverie You're in the arms of the age May he find, I hope he find, some comfort there. So tired of a straight line, and everywhere you look, there's vultures and thieves at your back. On twisting, you keep on building the lies that you make up for all that you have. They don't make no difference, no escape one last time. Cause it's easier to believe in this sweet madness. Of the angel far away from me, from this dark old hotel, the endlessness that you feel, you are pulled from the wreckage of your silence. song, Sarah McLaughlin. By a lonely prison wall, I heard a young girl call. But Michael, they're taking Away because you stole your fading's coin, so the young might see the dawn. Now your ship lies waiting for you in the bay. Where 
once we watched small free bird fly And our love was on the way We got a dream and a song to sing This lonely ground of fields got the ride Lonely on the wall, I heard a young man calling. That nothing matters, Mary, when you're free against the prison and the crown. I rebelled and they ran me down. We must raise our child with dignity. Lord, life feels back and run. Where once we watched the small free bird flying, now we watch them fly. do a lively version of that but that's a nice that's a nice big big irish song that is well that, that that's me i'm gonna i'm gonna sing you one more now so look, I've, i went out there and i it was just it made me smile but there was about 40 people still there i don't know if you've just fell asleep with your ipads on you might all have nodded off and we've only got a few now so look again thank you for your company uh, have a peaceful night and um i'll sing you this this is called wonderful world let me just check the last few comments there's people to mind you he came back did he Steve sure that's why he's been doing that. What's he do that? Oh, we, we went a bit. <laughs> oh, look, we've gone right down here. Uh, Hannah Casbin, truly night, Steve. Yeah, I'm, re I'm really going to go now. It was easy listening to that. That's exactly what I wanted to do. Kenzie Graham, uh, Jane Boyett's there, Sheila Fink, Janet Maltby. Hello, Janet. Uh, Hannah Casbin, uh, none night from Rita. Arms of the Angel, isn't that a nice song, you know? Um, Sarah McLaughlin's song. So you haven't gone, no, <laughs> Carol. I was going to go. I was going to go. But it's just when I saw that there was loads of you still there, and I just thought, well, it's like an encore, isn't it, really? You know, anyway. We didn't believe you finishing early. Never happened before. It doesn't normally, but it's good. You know, I'm going to sing this one, then, because I want to have a cup of tea, and I want to put the news on. 
and because uh, I want to know how Boris is and what, what's going on. Any updates? I just want to see them. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Night night. Yeah, funny isn't it. There's, there are some people that have gone. I tell you, I'll get I'll get in trouble for that tomorrow. They'll tell me off. Do you like the set? The set's coming on, isn't it? We've got a. I changed a couple of lights around today. I've got a little green there, a little red there. It's a bit red, a little bit. A little bit woman of the night sort of red there, isn't it? I might have a bit more of that fish in parsley. I bought, I picked a couple up. They're really nice, they are. I don't like them orange things, though, them weird things. I don't mind the peas. From me on my sofa to you on your sofa, no night. <laughs> I see trees of green, red roses too. I watch them bloom for me and a few. And I think to myself, oh, mama, what a wonderful world. I see skies of blue. So white, the bright blessed day, and the dark sacred night, and I think to myself, what a wonderful world. The colors of the rainbow so pretty in the sky. There are so People passing by, I see friends saying, How'd you do? They really say that I'm in love with you. I hear my baby cry, I watch him grow. You know much more. Colors of the rainbow, pretty in the sky, are also on the faces. People passing by, I see friends holding hands, singing, "How'd you do?" When they're really saying that I'm so in love with you, I hear baby crying. And I watch him grow. He'll know much more than his dad will ever know. And I think to myself, oh, mama, what a wonderful world. Think to myself, what a wonderful. Everybody, sleep tight.